Today I'm going to show you how to get infinite delta v in Kerbal Space Program. Let's build our rocket. I start with a command pod, and after adding a small fuel tank and a parachute, I then add a Cal 1000 controller. I actually add two, one on each side, to keep the rocket symmetrical. Below the fuel tank, I place an engine plate and set the attachment node mode to 4x1. On the four outer nodes, I attach four spark engines. I then open up the Cal editor and underclock these engines, so they produce no thrust but actually refill our tanks when fired. If you're not sure what engine underclocking or overclocking is, check out my video on the topic. On the inner node, I attach a vector engine, then overclock it to have massive thrust. But just like that, we're ready to launch. Now when we activate our engines, we will get insane thrust from the vector, but the sparks will be refueling the tank at a rate quicker than the vector can drain it. Just like that, we have infinite delta V.